and sports like pickleball, ping pong, and stuff. And these sports don't really want all that leverage and competitive advantages. So that's why we tend to stress the health. And that's where guys like Ralph Zaransky come in because they've studied brain chemistry. They've studied the parts of the brain. They can tell you what the Agmadula does. They can tell you what <laughs> what all these things do. The connection, but the uh, hippocampus, but. Um, it's the corpus callosum that we feel like you build and get integrated. So that's why we stress this postural advantages to being able to have everything lined up and be able to walk. But also the, um, the I want to say, um, dopamine levels that go up and are created by uh, constantly developing both sides of your brain, both sides of your body. The fingertips grow the brain. Um, that's what this program's all about is, is learning to, to use both the fingertips and there's little things that, you know, but if you're just using one side, developing one side, same as it would physically, you get sort of lopsided or you get overly competitive. You get, you know, we always, even when, when you start this journey with a two-handle racket and developing your ambidextrous and your brain integration, your right side has had more messages. So you have to start sending those messages to the left side and hitting those shots, even if it's just in practice. And, you know, but there, there will be times where he says, hey, let me just win this. And that's okay, you know, we just, all of us that started this racket, there was sort of a spirituality beyond it. We come from different religions, Christians. Um, uh, we study a lot of Buddhist philosophy. A lot of our philosophy is, you know, full intention, no attachment. That's why we're able to keep going, showing up, uh, competing, and doing our best. And then when we're done, you know, no attachment. It's a, that's more of a Buddhist saying. If you ever get one of our freestyle rackets, it has a lot of the sayings painted on to it. Full intention, no attachment. Your suffering comes from attachment. We do our best in competition and let the chips fall, but we're not attached to winning. And and then that's all you can do. But if you're sort of lopsided and you can see it sometimes in people that, you know, that they're super competitive, what we feel like Ralph's program and our racket brings is creativity.